Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Look called Victor, you, you can take it in the hall if you want. Victor? Yes, he said that you know him. Uh, hello, Derek. Yeah, it's me, Victor Pendlebury. Remember me? Yeah, yeah, I thought you would do. Um, she's asked me to tell you that she can't really go through with the wedding tomorrow. She's, uh, she's decided to come away with me instead. <laughs> I'm sorry, mate. Very sorry. Sarah. Right. <laughs> brilliant, mate. Brilliant. <laughs> and very childish if I Shut up, Percy. Killed you. Wait for it, wait for it. What's the matter, mate? It's not bad news, is it? All right. Who was the comedian on the phone? Comedian? What comedian? Was it you? Me. No, it was me. How did you know? Well, for one thing, Victor Pendlebury has a voice once heard, never forgotten. You find that with opinionated people. <laughs> and for another thing, <clears throat> Mavis would never desert me for him. Never in a million years. Well, it was a good try. No <laughs> offence, man, mate. Yeah. None take. Good good luck, luck. Give that man a large brandy on me for keeping his wits about him on the eve of his execution. Quite right, sir. You've got to ask Sergeant Major Sutton's permission for you to marry. Let him through. Right. <laughs> he makes a very good drunk, doesn't he? Being one sort of a bunch to start with. Mavis, you're never on one of your book crawls tonight. Nay, lass. Where's Derek? Derek? Derek is long gone. Uh, he wanted to be fighting fit for tomorrow, isn't that right? Yeah. Everybody? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. 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 No, mate. Right. Right. Hey, uh, hey, what are we going to do with him? I'll tell you what I'm...